Uh, it is the farewell ceremony today of the Axiom 4 aircraft. Group Captain Shubhanshu Shukla and others will be coming back to planet Earth uh, very, very soon from space. Let's go live across. We're getting those visuals of that ceremony happening on board the International Space Station. And we also hope that uh, the time you spent here will become uh, unforgettable mo moments in your lives. So thank you so much. And now I will hand the microphone to Action for Commander Peggy Whitson. Thanks, Tak. And we really enjoyed ourselves up here. It was an amazing experience. It's always great to work with a bunch of professionals, which you are, but it's even more special to work with folks that have become our friends <laughs> even more deeply. And we um, really appreciate the fact that uh, the camaraderie and the teaching that you guys offered to the crew was really exceptional. And we thank you. And Tibi, to you. This will probably make me cry as well, but <laughs> I, will try, I will try my best. Hi, everyone. The X4 crew came here with a purpose and a really busy agenda. And uh, along the way, we made a lot of things happen. We made science, first of all. We made better and better pictures from Earth. We got actually better and better in photography. Uh, we made some funny videos, too. Uh, but we did much more. We made lots of people proud on the ground. We, la we made lots of people, lots of colleagues and co-workers cheering us. We made children excited. We made friends on orbit. We made some crew members laugh. We also made some inside jokes and belly laughs. Uh, so I can say we made it, we did it. We made the return happen. We did all these and made these because we were humans and we were people on board an international space station collaborating highly efficiently and peacefully in the name of science. This was a great mission and we enjoyed it the most. I think the outcome and the, uh, and the impact of this mission will be much, much greater than the scientific results that we will achieve. So now we will return home and we will spread the word in our countries that these things are within our reach. Uh, these things are possible even for smaller countries like ours. And, um, and, we will, and we will talk about these with our countrymen for sure a lot. So thank you very much for having us on board the ISS. And um, I will say some words in Hungarian as well. Kedves magyarok, ha bár erősen korlátozott volt a hozzáférésem az otthoni hírekhez az elmúlt három hétben, úgy hallottam, hogy sok minden történt és sok minden változott. Én annyit el tudok mondani, hogy itt mi történt az űrállomás fedezetén az elmúlt három hétben. Rengeteg munka, rengeteg tudomány, rengeteg ötlet, rengeteg, rengeteg kitartás történt annak érdekében, hogy ezt a programot sikerre vigyük. Én nagyon remélem, hogy annyira büszkék vagytok rám és a programra, mint amennyire én büszke voltam a kutatóinkra az elmúlt három hétben. Magyarország az elmúlt hetekben visszakerült, a világűr térképére, és higgyétek el, ez innen feltől nagyon jól látszik. És az elmúlt hetekben Magyarország éveket lépett előre olyan tudományterületeken, mint a biológia, dozimetria, táplálkozástudomány, termékfejlesztés, és még sorolhatnám. Az én személyes célkitűzésem és kívánsága a Magyar Humor Program egy valami hatalmasnak legyen a kezdete, és azért, hogy ez megtörténjen, én arra szeretnék mindenkit kérni, hogy higgyen abban, hogy mi, magyarok, képesek vagyunk olyan dolgokra, mint amit az elmúlt három hétben elértünk. Ezért, hogyha kell, akkor a gyerek, ha táncolni akar, menjen táncolni, hogyha a gyerek sakkozni akar, menjen sakkozni, és hogyha anya azt mondja, hogy tévé csak a házi után van, akkor tessék megcsinálni a házi feladatot, és csak azután tévézni. Mert mi magyarok megmutattuk már olimpián és világbajnokságon, és most a világűrben is, hogy képesek vagyunk szinte a lehetetlenre is. És nem csak a világűrben van szükségünk olyan tehetségekre, hanem az élet minden területén. Úgyhogy ezúttal most hazamegyünk. És megígérem, hogy elmesélek mindent, ami itt az elmúlt három hétben történt, de csak akkor, hogyha ti is elmeséltek, hogy milyen volt azt a követést végignézni Magyarországról, az otthonunkról az elmúlt három hétben. Oda találkozunk. Thank you, Tibi, for setting the precedence. I can speak as long now. So, <laughs> uh, 
it has been an incredible journey. Uh, I did not imagine all this when I started on Falcon 9 on 25th. And I think uh, it has been made amazing or uh, incredible because of the people who are involved. Uh, the, the team that is standing behind me, uh, you guys have made it really special for us being here on the station. And it was an incredible joy to be here and working alongside with a bunch of professionals like you. Uh, over the past two and a half weeks or so, we have done a lot of science on the station. We have done uh, outreach activities and also look back at the Earth, <laughs> whatever time we found. We were always looking out the window. And um, it, it, has, it almost seems uh, magical to me. And I would like to uh, take this opportunity to thank my country and all their citizens for supporting this mission and me with all their hearts. And um, I would like to thank Gistro for uh, making this happen. All the colleagues at Gistro who have worked tirelessly uh, in developing all the protocols, the science, and the outreach activities. The researchers back in India, the students who developed the uh, outreach items that I carried. I would also like to thank NASA and its international partners, Axiom Space, SpaceX, for ensuring that we were trained adequately well and providing all the support round the clock and all the people who were sitting on ground supporting this mission making it extremely successful. I, I, I would agree with what TB said that these missions are go have much far-reaching uh, implications beyond science and that is what I believe uh, that this would this mission would also uh, do in all of our respective countries as well. Going back from here I carry with me a lot of memories uh, uh, and the learnings out of this mission that I would try and spread back. But the one thing that really sticks to me is what humanity is capable of when all of us come together from different parts of the world and work for a common goal or a common uh, objective. It is truly incredible. So thank you, everyone. And it has been an incredible mission for me. And now, some words for my country in Hindi. It's been a long time for my journey. लेकिन अब जैसे मेरी ये यात्रा खत्म होने वाली है, आपकी और मेरी यात्रा अभी बहुत लंबी है। हमारी ह्यूमन स्पेस मिशन की जो यात्रा है, वो बहुत लंबी है और बहुत कठिन भी है। लेकिन मैं आपको विश्वास दिलाता हूँ कि अगर हम निश्चय कर लें, तो तारा अभी प्राप्यंत है। Even stars are attainable। 41 साल पहले कोई भारतीय और कहीं ना कहीं मुझे लगता है कि हम सब ये जानना चाहते हैं कि आज भारत कैसा दिखता है मैं आपको बताता हूं आज का भारत स्पेस से महत्वाकांक्षी दिखता है आज का भारत निडर दिखता है आज का भारत कॉन्फिडेंट दिखता है आज का भारत गर्व से पूर्ण दिखता है और इन्हीं सब कारणों की वजह से मैं एक बार फिर से कह सकता हूं कि आज का भारत अभी भी सारे जहाँ से अच्छा दिखता है। जल्दी धरती पर मुलाकात करते हैं। धन्यवाद। I will now hand over the mic to my colleague Swav. Thank you, Shooks. Thank you all for such beautiful words, and thank you to all the people here during this 11 astronauts, cosmonauts who gathered together on the International Space Station and helped us. To, to execute this mission. We are four, but uh, to be honest, your work is, is you, we couldn't do it without you. We, we couldn't do it without, as well, many people on the ground. So these are hundreds of people working back in Poland, in our countries, at the European Space Agency, at NASA, at Axiom Space, who make this, this mission happen. So I want to thank you all. Um, thank you for such a beautiful, uh, for hosting us on the ISS. For me, that was one memory I will always have in, in my head is our first day when we crossed that hatch and we floated through the station and for the first time we were guided by you to, to Cupola to look ba back on Earth. This, that was one of the most magical moments of my life. Um, I think the International Space Station is a beautiful international collaboration. And these places, such labrachis, are, are really important to, to be preserved. And look where we can go when we work together, we collaborate on common platform, co common science, then sky is no, no longer the limit. We, we can explore space, we can explore science, we can explore technology and build new solutions for the future. Um, 
I think this this really speaks to me very deeply to to be able to, to collaborate and attain these these results. Let me maybe switch to, to Polish. Drogie Pol Polki, drodzy Polacy, dziękuję wam po pierwsze za, e, za zaufanie i za to, że mogłem was tutaj reprezentować na Międzynarodowej Stacji Kosmicznej e, podczas pierwszej polskiej misji na, na, na ISS. E, Dziękuję za, za to zaufanie. Mam nadzieję, że również misja przyniosła dużo dobrego Polsce, kosmosowi, nauce polskiej i również polskiej technologii, przynajmniej pewną część rozpoznawalności. Duża część tej misji to wasza praca, praca naukowców, ludzi na ziemi, edukatorów, polskich szkół. Natomiast Mam nadzieję, że to jest dopiero początek, że to nie jest koniec tej, tej przygody, że tak naprawdę dopiero zaczynamy rozwijać się i będziemy bazować później na tej technologii w przyszłości. Nie mogę się doczekać mojego powrotu na Ziemię, chociaż jestem troszeczkę smutny, że, że tak naprawdę misja dobiega końca, natomiast wiem, że jeszcze dużo pracy przed nami i mam nadzieję, że tak samo wy, jak i ja, jesteście na to gotowi. Jeszcze raz bardzo dziękuję. To... Taka platforma jak Międzynarodowa Stacja Kosmiczna to niesamowite laboratorium na orbicie i mam nadzieję, że będziemy takie miejsca odwiedzać coraz częściej jako Polacy. Dziękuję i do zobaczenia. And I'll hand back the mic to talk with these words. Thank you. Thank you and have a safe flight back home and uh, we will see you again soon on the ground. Thank you. Thank you to the Axiom 4 crew and Expedition 73, a station that concludes the event, and we are now resuming operational audio communications. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.